Hello, everybody, and welcome to Gamesmeister with me, the Gamesmeister. Now, I've seen a couple of you already in the comments saying that the Gamesmeister is late. Well, let me tell you, the Gamesmeister is never late. No, I see early. He arrives precisely when he means to. And I am arriving today with more sage, expert video game wisdom for you, the poor noobs of the Access community. And I will be helping two pitiful noobs today. The first of which, Tam, couldn't even be bothered to send in a video request. And so I, in my infinite benevolence and wisdom, have had to reconstruct what I imagine Tam said uh, in, a, in a video of my own, which you can see now. Games Meister, I am rubbish at climbing castles, yet yeah, I'm tasked with climbing a silly castle without dying in a storm with time pressure. Please help me get a gold relic time on Stormy Ascent. Right, now, Stormy Ascent, a gold relic time, Tam wants, in Stormy Ascent. Tricky, tricky, but not impossible, especially if you're as good at games as I am. Now, the first thing you need to do to get a gold relic time in Stormy Ascent is finish Stormy Ascent because you can't actually activate the relic race until you've finished it. Now, in, in the interest of authenticity, and because I like to do things very thoroughly, I have prepared a save where I haven't finished Stormy Ascent. I, I know it's very gracious of me. Obviously, I've done it, really, on my actual save, and I've, I've got the Platinum Relic and the Platinum Trophy. But in the interest of really showing you the full journey on what you have to do to get the Gold Relic on Stormy Ascent, I thought I'd start, you know, from the beginning, okay? First, we're just going to finish Stormy Ascent. Then, once we've finished Stormy Ascent, get your notepads out, especially you, Tam. Make sure you're listening. Once we finish Stormy Ascent, then you will be able to activate the Relic Race and we will go for the Gold Relic. I believe the Gold Relic time is 4 minutes and 30 seconds. So, in the intro, if you're interested, you could get your stopwatch out and, and time how long it takes me to get through the level, just normally, and then we will see, we will see what happens. So, Stormy Ascent, quite a tricky level if you don't know what you're doing. Always good to get a mask. Note that down. Get a mask. Now, the first thing you want to do is really, and it's good to, you know, it's a good practice. You want to time your jumps up here. Watch those steps. Now, there's a there's an evil scientist there who likes to chuck poke. Don't let him get you. You'd hop on there. Little hoppity hop up here. Now, there's like spikes there, you'll see. Don't want to hit those, obviously. Don't want to do that either. So... Watch for when they're coming out. And then this little... It's tricky, this. It's tricky, see? See? I'm showing you how tricky it is. Watch this, Tam. Up we go! Why would he get up there? It's what many confused people might say when they're playing Stormy Ascent for the first time. You gotta get up there quickly! Like that. Like that. Like a hero. Okay, and you get one of those embryo heads. Now, always be paying attention to the timing. Timing is key. You don't wanna be. See the little swipey man there? Don't wanna hit him. I've lost my mask because I like to live on the edge. 
Time this well. Like that. Time it well. Don't get hit by that scientist's potions. No, I'm just doing it nice and carefully and making sure I don't die. Obviously, when it, when it comes to getting the gold relic, you'll probably want to do this a little bit quicker. Which I'll obviously be doing for you in due course. Checkpoints. Always handy. Hit the checkpoints. Don't do that! Oh, that! Oh, that! Oh, don't do this! Whatever you do! I had it under control, and I'm still alive. Because I am the Games Meister, and I have shown you how best to... To not die during those... St now, this is a sticky one, this. See the... See, now, watch the timing. Got to be careful on the timing here. Don't want to go too soon. You don't want to go too early. You want to go now. Oh, God. See? Expertly done by the Games Meister. As usual! Oh. Now, it's every two, so not that one. That's where you want to go. Hoobly boobly! Interesting. A little hop there. A little. Oh! The Games Meister has it under control. Watch this, Tam. A little hop, hoppity do there. That's it. Now, when it comes to doing the relic. You obviously you can't make any mistakes at all. You have to just do it. You have to just do it perfectly. Oh god. Come here! Oh, that was. There. There we go. Expertly done by the Games Meister, of course. I mean, of course. No! <laughs> the Games Meister knows what he's doing. Now, calm on this one, because it can get away from you. <laughs> doing it quickly now. Not advised. See, because that can happen. Now, Tam, pay attention. What you saw there... What you saw there, Tam, was a game over. And that is not what you want. That's not what you want. Now, you can laugh all you like. Ooka, ooka. But what I'm doing is I am showing Tam and everybody at home the pitfalls of rushing. Now, obviously you, you need to rush when it when it comes time to do the the gold relic. You've got to finish Thank you. You gotta finish the level in four minutes and thirty seconds, okay? Four minutes and 30 seconds without dying, without using any checkpoints from start to finish. No mistakes. Bash, bash, bosh, all the way up. Because I am very generous, what I'm doing in this stream is showing you from the very beginning of the process. Just, just to get us warmed up. There's no point in me doing like the gold relic time straight away. It'd be, it'd be too fast. You wouldn't be able to follow what I was doing. And, you know, no one's going to learn anything, are they? So I'm going to do the level... You know, normally first, just just finish it, so you can see what you got to do. Okay, that's what we're going. That's what we're doing right now. So you're welcome, Tam. Oh, get up! Get Get! No! Oh. No! No! Yes. This one's really hard to um, pay attention to what I'm showing you, okay? You do it like that. 
Hardest bit of the level, actually, I think, that staircase. Very tricky. Very tricky. Oh. Well, it's going in every time I'm coming up, isn't it? What are you supposed to do, Tam Might Ah! Get up there! No! Ah! Oh. This hasn't been the quickest, I will grant you. But Stormy Ascent is hard. I... I am real! I show you the reality of games, okay? Games are hard. And I will show you how to persevere and get through. Get up the flipping steps, Crash Tap! Another very important lesson. What I'm demonstrating here is the the frustration and the rage that you all might feel and that you all will feel when you're doing this bit of the level right at the beginning. Because this is where the red, the gold relic run can, can just end. Can just end, okay? Right, kick up the Okay, and what you don't want to do is allow your anger to get the better of you. Because as soon as you start getting carried away, a little bit spiky and fally, then you won't be able to do it. Okay, calm. Calmness. Don't scream and don't cry. And you jump! I mean, what are you supposed to do? I hear you all asking. What are you supposed to do at that point? The stairs just go away, don't they? And it's not, you can't even jump up there, stupid bandicoot. I've done it before. I got past this bit. Why can't I do it now? You're all saying at home, wondering what's going on. And that is a, a gaming phenomenon known as, I know I can do this itis where it'll be something that you've done in the past and usually it'll be like in a boss fight or a tricky level like this one and there'll be a bit that you've easily got past before and then you just get a mental block on it and won't be able to do it again Fee! Different stars, you stupid creature! Right, we're there. No more of that. Oh my god! And then you go up here, expertly, like that. You get rid of the scientist guy, like that. And you get to the bit that you've got to in the past, and that you should be at now, but you're not, because you weren't paying attention and you died. Okay, this is all simple stuff here. Checkpoint. mistimed that just for you tam so you can see how not to do it okay you gotta when it starts at the top there that's when you got and you gotta jump end middle then end and that'll get you across that little bit there when the bird is going down that's when you want to go for it and then you need a little hop across there spin the man spin the graspy man this is difficult this bit you really got to nail the timing on that be brave It'll, it'll stay there for longer than you think. Oh, no! Don't do that! Okay. Sir Trevelot says, Can you show me that first bit again, please? Probably, Sir Trevelot. I probably can. And if it does come to it, that's what I will say. I will say this is for you, Sir Trevelot. But right now, I'm going to show you how to do the rest of the level for 
Tam's sake and everyone else who wants to see a gold rush. So wait till it gets to the end. Look, you've got to wait till that little platform has reached the end. That is the correct timing to jump on it. Then you hop across there. Wait till the bird is going down and then a little dink across there. Spin that, man. And then wait for... I've waited too long there, but it's okay. And this is a bit where you've got to be just a little bit patient. You got That's the time. That's the time to do it, okay? The time I did it before was not very good. This is the bit... I didn't do so well last time, but we get that done, okay? Now, this is... This, you've got to be careful here. It's now. And it's now. And it's now. Oh, no! It's not then! Flipping heck. I've got... So, when it gets to the end, everybody, and then end, middle, end, and you're across. End, middle, end, across, and when the bird is lower, that's when you leap. Spin the spinny man. Be patient here. These steps, they stay out for a little bit longer than you might think. Okay, so we're going to leap now. We're going to wait, and then we're going to go. Now, don't go then. Go now. Perfectly timed, as you can see. Then, not then. That's the one you want. Not that one. Brilliant. Now, this is difficult, this one. This is the one that can catch you out if you're not paying attention. You want to get up there, see? Like I just did. And then a hoppity do. Wait, to, I've mistimed that. I've died. Just to show you how not to jump across those birds. And I hope everybody's been making notes. If anyone in the comments wants to sort of like give us a rundown of what you've learned so far from the in infinitely wise Gamesmeister. So everybody at home has can follow. That would be lovely. Right. Concentrate now. Not then! See, I was, went too early then. Now, just for you, Sir Trevorlot, I did this just for you. I'm going to show you how to do that beginning bit again. Pay attention this time, Sir Trevorlot, because I know you obviously... I didn't show it to you enough times. Before! Wait. Spin. Jump. Hop. Now this is the trickiest bit, I think, in the entire level! So Trevlock might say. And anyone else who struggles on this... YP96-6 says, you're too kind, my lord. Yes, I know. How thoughtful of the games, Meister, says JRox86. I know! So kind! I am kind and wise. Maybe we could start a poll to decide whether I am more kind or wise. Which, which of those two wonderful qualities... Does the games meister have in more abundance kindness or wisdom it's going to be close because i have lots of both and sometimes they're in they're in conflicts with with one another in my in my insane amount of kindness i will sometimes neglect my wisdom just to descend to the level of like the average gamer like the like all of you see there what i've done there has been like i wonder what the average gamer would do if they were jumping around here now i i should show them so they don't feel left out and excluded so i want these you know i want these tutorials to to be to be real 
and for you to be able to identify with the the trials and tribulations of getting up those steps at the beginning of Stormy Ascent. I hate them. The average gamer might say they're difficult. So you jump, you want to hop over the last step on that one. So I hope you've enjoyed the fact that I've gone back here again, Sir Trevelot, okay? If anyone would like, if anyone is still unclear of how you get through the uh, opening of, of this level, uh, do let me know in the comments. I might be kind enough to show you again, okay? Depends how I'm... I mean, that's not hard, that. That's not hard. It just isn't hard. And I'm, for some reason, showing you how it could be! Why is that hard? Oh. Oh. Look, the whales of... No! Of the average gamer there. Too early. I got too excited. There you go. For everyone who was asking, and I don't know who was asking, I've just shown you how to do the beginning of the level yet again. Right? Pay attention, because you might not see it again. Sometimes you just get unlucky with this one, and it's just not there. The timing, you've got to wait a bit for the timing to be right, like now. Jump over the top step on that one, and you'll make it. Don't jump into the scientists. Pay attention to this, Tam, because I'm about to just do it for you, okay? Now, Tam wanted to know how to get the gold relic. But I'm showing you not just how to get the gold relic, but to how just to finish the level before you even have the chance to get the gold relic. On a specially prepared save where I hadn't done it, of course. In reality, why? Honestly, I think that's the hardest bit of this entire level. That staircase there. The hardest bit. You have to do that on it somehow. So my my pro tip for getting up that first step the first staircase there is to do it somehow, okay? Just just don't refuse to, to fall down. That's what you've got to do. Just refuse to not do it and you might do it. Don't run into the scientist's goop. Spin him out. Jump on that. Jump over there. Jump up here. Let it take you around. Jump on that. Now, this is the bit I was making look hard before. It's not hard. Here's the first checkpoint. And that's where you want to get to. 
That means you don't have to do the bit at the beginning again unless you get a game over, which I won't this time because I'm just going to do it for you all because I'm, you know, running out of time. We've got a second, we've got a second noob request to address in this stream and uh, I decided to show up 12 minutes after the advertised time at the start of this stream obviously because I arrived when I mean to which was 12 minutes later than the advertised time so we got some time pressure don't do that okay Tam that was too late that one goes quickly so you've got to be really oh, that, I've done that too late as well oh don't why is he just standing on that Right, when it goes to the end, that's when you've got to do it. You might think it's too soon to do the jump, but it won't be. It just won't be. It will be the right time. Now, this one, tricky. I've done that a bit too late, but it's okay, because remember, that staircase. Don't jump there. Tempting to jump there. Jump there, remember? Let it take you round. Again, that was too late. I did the same mistake as I did before. That thing, just so you know, so you can see, I've done the same mistake again. And now I will show you once more how to do the beginning of Stormy Ascent. Fernando Babylonia says, will the stream run later to compensate or did Gamesmeister add extra pressure for himself for fun? No, of course, the Games... The Gamesmeister... We don't overrun streams on the Gamesmeister, okay? Yeah, when you come to... Thank you, Kira, 3572, for clarifying what happened there. Yes, it was a game over. I've shown you a few game overs now. And that's what's going to happen to you as well average gamers who are watching this stream you're going to get loads of game overs when you come to do this level for the first time so what's the point of me you know just showing you straight off the bat how to do this expertly you're not going to learn anything are you everyone learns from mistakes okay i am making mistakes so you don't have to Get, just don't just refuse to not do that. Refuse to not do that, okay? I jumped too early. Because you just have to. You just have to. There's no other way. He doesn't ju just get up there. Get, don't refuse. See, there was loads of refusing going on there. Oh. Where are my glasses? There they are. All right. I'm going to do this quickly now so you can see. Hardest bit in the entire game. Coming up! Get up there! Don't you just refuse. See? You refuse to not make it. That's how you get up that bit. As I was saying before, you know, there's no point at all in me just expertly doing it straight away. Okay? You gotta You're not gonna learn anything. As I've said in previous Games Meister streams, every death makes you wise. Makes you wiser. Every death makes you wiser. Which is why I am so wise. And if you went onto the internet and you typed in Gold Relic Stormy Ascent, you'd probably just see someone doing it. Well, what's the point in that? That's like, you know, training to run the world record 100 meter sprint time. 
and just looking at world record 100 meter sprint time and seeing Usain Bolt running it in 9.57 seconds or whatever he does and then assuming that just because you've watched that video you'll also be able to run in 9.57 seconds you need to be taught you need it doesn't teach you anything does it seeing it just happen seeing like really good people doing it straight away and that's what you get with games meister you get raw unfiltered truth and wisdom and you get crash not no! you get calmness you get preparedness you get occasionally you get given an extra checkpoint from the game if it feels sorry for you Which can be used! Why would I do that? And the average gamer would say... Oh, he's there. See, and then you make the same mistake again. Lucy Sobe, who's in the chat, says... When I'm watching Games Meister, I think... Serenity. And I'm glad you think that, Lucy, because oh, they don't, they just don't seem to, they don't, they don't, they don't seem to be in the right place, those things. To, to do what I want them, I've, I've mistimed that, I've not! So, then you need to hop onto that one. And then a little hop onto that one, then you're across, all right? Now, this is where it went wrong last time for me, and I've done exactly the same thing again. for a bit. <laughs> Just for a bit. I hope he doesn't laugh again. <laughs> yes. Just want to... A little... A little composure break. A little composure break. Summer Games Fest tonight, everybody. Uh, and I hope you'll be watching the Summer Games Fest event. Because later on, we might have a little little after-party stream for you. Let's go through all the most exciting announcements and of reveals that are happening tonight. That won't be me, though. Games Mice doesn't get involved with such frivolity. Games Meister exists only to game! Now this is this is where we where you really get into the weeds of it, okay? We're now at that stage where we've done the beginning bit of the level so many times you'll be like you'll be angry, you'll be impatient, you'll be like, I know I can do this, why can't I do this? But this is when you have to keep your call cool on this bit, the impossible stairs. The impossible stairs. The way to do the impossible stairs is just to refuse to fall down them. I'll now demonstrate my strength of will on the impossible stairs. Ready? Here you go. No, I won't fall down. I did that time. The impossible stairs is coming up once again. Here they are. I've not even got onto them that time. So impossible well, are they? Even these ones are now proving themselves difficult. It's a hop. It's a jump. It's a diddly day. It's a jump. You have to jump on nothing. You jump on nothing and you use your force of will to do it on the impossible stairs, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Make sure then you jump on that. Then you do that. And then he's gonna swipe at you, but don't worry about him. You're more powerful. This is hard. You jump before the top step, see? Pro tip. You wait and then you go. And you spin. 
Now you wait for that to come down there. You wait. You go. You wait. You go. Wait and go. Wait and go. Be decisive. Be precise. Always push the button. A l you know, never take it for granted that you've pressed the jump button because the game doesn't care. Hop when it gets to the end. Use the middle. Swipey swipers in there. Don't go at that point. Go there. You follow it down, see? This is the tricky one. And it was still, it was too late. It was too late. Even though that absolutely looked like it was fine, it was too late. The timing on the, they move fast, all of these little doodars. You can never, you've always got to go probably a quarter of a second sooner than you might have thought. It's tricky. You go there. See? Much sooner. You hit the, the pity checkpoint. It's a really good strategy to use is to be deliberately not that good at the game at the start so that it gives you... I don't know how to do that bit anymore! An exasperated Tam would say as he goes for the gold relic. When are you supposed to do it? When are you supposed to jump? Tam might say. It, clearly not then. There's nothing there. It's too high. Fuck. Get over there. When? When? That one? Yeah, that one. And then you go, and then you do a little hop there, and then you're across. So this is the bit where you want to be... That second bird needs to be on its way down. Before you... Why is it still not done it? Ah! Don't get cross. Don't get cross with the game. I see the poll results are in, and wisdom has been voted for. <sighs> Don't get cross with the game. The game is fair. And you have to, you have to maintain composure. Otherwise, these kind of things will just catch you out. But now, everybody, because the impossible stairs are the most impossible bit of this entire level, I'm going to show you once again how to use your force of will to not fall down them. See that? That was so much force of will I was using there to just not fall down them. And there. Ha and there. You just wait till we get to the actual gold relic bit. Which I will definitely get to.
That's when you jump. And then you wait. And remember this one. Do it way earlier than you probably think. Hit the pity checkpoint. Strategically activated. Ah, oh, don't jump then. I hate that bit. Two lives to go. Oh. You are. <laughs> A laugh of enjoyment and fun. Oh. Oh, I've gone too soon. Oh. It's the fun song, and then you do the fun song. Oh, the fun song. The fun that has been had! Lovingly bites your knuckle, and press retry. It's X to retry level, by the way, everybody. Just to make sure you know how to get past the... Uh, the game over screen there. What's the time? It's nearly five o'clock. Remember force of will here, everybody. Well, here it comes. Force of will, force of will, force of will! And you'll get up the stairs. You just have to believe. As I always do. Oh! Holy! Laughing from the fun. So, essentially, Tam, so you get the gold relic on Stormy Ascent. You you do everything I have done, and you avoid doing all of the pitfalls I've shown you. Do everything I've done. Go a little bit further through the level. You'll finish it. Then start the level again. Hit the clock. Do the whole level again without dying fast, and you'll get the gold relic, okay? You're very welcome. You're very welcome. But right now, what we have to do, what we have to do is we've got another request. We've got another request. Who is our second request from today? Help me, Gamesmeister. You're my only hope. Years ago, I almost platted COD Modern Warfare, but the trophy best of the best always eluded me. To this day, I have never managed to beat the best time in the training course in FNG. My fate is in your hands, or whatever you hold the controller with. Now. This is a famous challenge. Sword in the Storm, as requested. How to get the best of the best trophy. And to do the best of the best trophy, what you have to do is clear the training course, which is, happens right at the start of the game. You've got to clear it in under 15.1 seconds. Okay? It's simple. Simple. So... 
average gamers of the world who are watching, wondering how to do this. I'm about to show you. All right. Sean. Just another day at the office. Thirteen says no way Rob's doing this. Well, it's a good job Rob isn't here. The games master is because the games master will show you and teach you. What I will do is I will teach you how to do it. Okay, that's what I do. I don't show. I teach. And that is infinitely more valuable. Pick up that MP5 and four flashbangs. So, do what you're told. You pick up the MP5. On my go, I want you to rope down to the deck and rush to position one. After that, you will storm down the stairs to position two. Ready? Then hit position three and four, following my precise instructions at each position. Yep. Grab the rope when you're ready. Are you ready? Now, what I'm probably going to do first is just show you how to do it, just where everything is. There's no point in just, like, watching it again, as I said before. You don't want to just go in and immediately watch an expert doing it. You'd be like, brr, 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 running through, flashbang, run, 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 done. Go, go, go! Hit the target! So, you come here. Now, as I said before, the other I'm not going to do it. I'm just showing you, okay? This won't be done in 15 seconds this time, all right? So you come round, and you come down here. Hit the targets. There's one down the stairs. There's gonna one that's going to pop up in here. Flashbang through the door. You want to throw a flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the target. There'll be a target there, a target five, there. Go. And then a little hop. Two more targets. Flashbang through the door. Flashbang in there. There's a couple of targets in there. Sprint to the finish. And then you sprint to the finish. Pretty good soap. And what you get is you a 55 or 52.8 seconds. And that was just showing you where everything is, where everything is, and where you got to do it. To do it in 15.1 seconds. Um, I'll show you how to do that now. Here we go. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! So. Position two, go! Kick, be careful with all of that. Don't get stuck on the doors. Don't get stuck on that door. Shoot that guy as you come downstairs really smoothly. Flashbang in there. Don't miss. He's going to be more people in there. And you run out here. And you do the diddly on that one and that one. Lots of diddling. In there. In you come. Don't reload so badly like that. And you come out, and you make sure you know which way you're going. You don't don't go through the door that you don't need to go through. That's very crucial. And out you come. All right, so that's enough. You'll do. Climb up the ladder if you want another go. Otherwise, come over to the monitors for a debrief. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Position two, go! Remember, don't get stuck on the Hit doors. The Flashbang through the door! Position four! Hit the targets! Position five, go! Hit the targets! Six, go! Flashbang through the door! Hit the targets! Reloading is annoying there. Final position, go! So yeah, you just gotta, you just gotta be faster and faster and faster every time. I believe in you, Mr. Meister. Oh Lord, says Melvin Sanchez. Obviously, amazed by the speed at which I am doing this. So you can take a double target down there if you are really good, like me. Like that. I have the flashbang ready. Don't get hit by the flashbang. Target, target. Into position four. Don't throw the flashbang yet. That was too soon for the flashbang. Now is when you want to throw the flashbang. Come out of here. 
Go there. Go there. Sprint out. And you'll get a 25 second time. It needs to be, somehow it needs to be 10 seconds quicker than that. But we'll show you how to do that now. Ready? Go, go, go. Here we go. Remember, there's one immediately in front of you. Try and get both of those in one, like I've done there. The run was slow. I've thrown a flashbang. Don't throw the flashbang. If you do the flashbang there, just start from the last checkpoint, because there's no point in even trying. Ready? Go, go, Hold. Go. The rope down here. One, and then both of these at the same time, like that, and then down we go. There's going to be one down the bottom of the stairs. Just get in like that. Flashbang. You need to do the flashbang earlier than that, ideally. And then you go one, you go two, and then you find the door. You find the door. Go go go! Hit the target. Position two. Go. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the target. Position five. Go. Come Hit on. Six. Go. Flashbang through the door. Hit the target. Ah, oh, so you get hit by the flashbang. Don't get hit by your own flashbang. Go, it's go, poor go. to do that. Hit the target. Position two. Go. Hit the target. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the targets. Position five. Go. Hit the targets. Six. Go. Flashbang through the door. Hit the targets. Final position. Go. Sprint to the finish. So that was really quick, but it was only 21.7 seconds. Okay. Gamer Pie says, Bye. This is painful to watch. Gamer Pie is in a lot of pain. A lot of pain. And I'm, I'm guessing Gamer Pie is off to play Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare themselves and just to do it first time. I'm expecting that's what they're off to do. I hope they have an amazing time doing it. Don't get stuck on that last door like that. Pretty good, so. He's seen better. He's seen better is what he has seen. I don't know which is quicker, just pressing reset, re redo checkpoint or coming up here. Don't miss the rope like that. Okay, don't do that. Don't do that. Okay. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Hit the targets. Flashbang through the door. Hit the targets. Position four. Position five. Go. Hit the targets. <sighs> Go, go, go! Hit the targets! And then you get to a stage like this, Sword of the Storm, where, go, go, you know, go. you'll probably just be like, okay, just Hit restart. The Position two, go. And you will have to do that quite a lot. Hit the targets! Flashbang through the door! I've missed the flashbang. You come down the stairs and you do the flashbang. Flashbang, go, okay? Go, go. That's what you got to do. That one, those two together, missed it. And as soon as, and you get to a stage where as soon as you start missing things, go, go, go. there's no point even trying. You know, you just got to re do the checkpoint. So remember, down the stairs and immediately I'm going to throw the flashbang through this door there and wait for it to go off. Hit that one, hit that one, miss that one. Throw a flashbang erroneously and restart the level. Go, go, and go. then, uh, so slide down the rope, everybody. Hit that one first. Hit those two at the same time. If you don't hit them, restart the level. But I have hit them. And then you don't get stuck on the door. Hit that. We've missed that one. See, it's quick. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Hit the targets. Don't miss that. Just don't miss it. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Position two, go! Hit the targets! Flashbang through 
flashbang through the door. Position four, hit the target. Position five, go. Hit the target. Six, go. Flashbang through the door. Hit the target. Ah, oh, the reload. The reload will do you. You've got to, you've got to do it all in one clip, ideally. Go, go, go. There's no time for reloading, so there's no time for bad accuracy. Got to make sure every shot is perfect. Flashbang through the door. Hit the targets. Position four. Position five. Go. Hit the targets. Six. Go. Where's that flashbang gone? I don't know. It's not gone in the right place. Obviously. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Hit the targets. Shoot the remaining targets. And if you want, the other targets. You can just do a little jump and the game won't constantly tell you to hit the other targets. I know I've gone past the targets. I'm doing it deliberately to show everybody at home what not to do. All right. That is the Games Meister's way. Don't do that. Well, now this is like the impossible stairs in Stormy Ascent, right? You know how to do them. You've done them before. But now you're doing them worse than you've ever done them before. You've done them so many times. That definitely hit. That definitely hit. I shot. My, my gun was facing it. I shot. Some reason it didn't decide. And again, did you ever see that at home? Go, go, go! Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Anyway, I hope. Oh, just wait here, Go, go, go! Hit the targets. Strength. Position two. Go. Oh God. Through the door. Through the door. Hit, the hit that one. Hit that Position one. Four. Did that not? See, I'm going too fast go, for the go, game go. now. That's how fast the game's Meister is. Game can't even keep up with me. That's how fast go, I'm playing. Hit the targets. Flashbang through the door. Hit the targets. Position four. Position five. Go. Hit the targets. Six. Go. Flashbang through the door. Spin round in a circle and shoot nothing. Just to end there. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Oh. Hit the targets. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the targets. Definitely hit that. And the door was like, no, actually, you can't come through. Sword in the Storm go, go, says, go. this has made my day, if not my year. I'm, I'm glad you're learning, Sword in the Storm, okay? And I hope after watching this stream, you will be a lot wiser than you were before you started. Don't bounce the flashbang into your face! Go, go, go! Oh, the go, go, go. When I, when I go to sleep tonight... In the floating void, I rest my head. I'm, I'm just going to hear go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Hit the targets. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the targets. Position five. Go. Hit the targets. Hit the targets. Go, go, go. Hope you're all enjoying yourselves and learning lots. Don't do that. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. It doesn't even let you jump off the edge. Go, go, go. So my advice to you, Sword in the Storm, please listen. Is to go, go, go and hit the targets, all right? Hit the targets. Go, go, go. Where did that flashbang go? Did it go through the door? Apparently it did. 
but I've waited too long to. I've, I didn't need to throw a flashbang. There. That they can have a flashbang as well. See, I gave them a flashbang as well as some bullets. Go go go! Hit the targets. Two. Go. Really, you need to do those two at the same time. Flashbang through the door. Flashbang through the door. Position hit that one. Hit that one. No, you've got to hit that one is what you've got to do. Not not hit it, which is what I've just done. <sighs> Grant Gendo says, Gamesmeister, I need your help with scoring an aerial goal in Rocket League. Well, Grant Gendo, what you should do is go, go, go. send in a, a request, and it can be a video or it can be as our two requestees have done today just a message and i'll do like a dramatic reconstruction of what i think the request looks like um where'd that flashbang go right by my feet uh and i will do a little video message on your behalf either way if you would like the games master's sage wisdom help and advice on expert gaming skills to aid you through a boss or a level or a time trial whatever it is don't hit that wall with the flashbangs it'll go off on your face if you want the games master's help Send me a message using the hashtag GamesMeister on social media. And maybe the GamesMeister will deign to help you. <coughs> Excuse me. There's a lot of pollen around and the GamesMeister can't take it. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Yeah, and Christian is learning so much. Excellent. Another tip. Don't stop to read YouTube comments whilst you're doing this. Probably going to be my quickest run now, isn't it? I'll miss it by like a second. It is as well. That was my best run. Uh, if I hadn't stopped at the beginning then to read the comment, I might have done that. You can climb the ladder or you can restart checkpoint. Usually I prefer to restart the checkpoint, but... Replace any flashbangs you use. Yes. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Shoot the other target. Yeah, shoot the other target. Go, go, go! Right! Shoot that target. Shoot go, those two go. targets. Run around here. Hit the targets! Ah, oh, the reload. He's gone with the reload. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. See, now I'm just missing the first shot every time. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. Hit the targets. Why is he reloading now? Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Go! Go, go, Hit the targets! Position two, go! Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Position two, go! Hit the targets! Flashbang through the door! Hit the targets! Position four! You can't have a reload. I don't know why he's reloading now. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Right, why is reload constantly on the screen? Reload now! Go, go, go! Don't want to see it again. Go, go, go! Reload before you go down. Go, go, go! Reload before you go down. Hit the targets! Position Good go, advice. Go. Otherwise you won't do it. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the target. Poor. You'll go, get go. very good at doing the last checkpoint scroll. Okay. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Reload. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Always reload before you start. Position two. Go. That was too many bullets expended and I ran into the wall. Reload before you start. Go down there. Hit the targets. Position two. Go. 
through the door, run down the stairs, hit that target. Flashbang in there. That was too slow. We'll try anyway. It's already too slow. Oh, 19.1. Not even my best time. Climb up the ladder if you want another go. Otherwise, come over to the monitors for a debrief. Lots of people in the chat commenting, PISTOL! Exactly like that. So what I might do is use the pistol. Just to show you how it won't work. See what happens when you use the pistol? You fall off the edge. Okay? So that's why you don't use the pistol. But I'll show you again if you like. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Position two, go! Hit the targets! See? Don't use pistol. Don't use it. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! See? It's rubbish. Rubbish! Go, go, go! I'm gonna keep using it though. Just Hit to spite targets. you all! Position two, go! To show how good at games I really am! Yes! The game's meister! Go, go, go! Hit the targets! James Mice doesn't care about the comments. Two, Knife that one if you want. The door. Where? I've. See? Using a pistol is just disorienting. Go, you don't go, know where go. you're going, you lose your rhythm. You're just shooting the air, see? Pistols are useless. But you wanted to see the pistol, go, go, go. so you're going to get the pistol. Hit the Rubbish. It's the pistol, it's not go, me. Go, go. Hit the targets. A bad workman blames his tools. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. But in this instance, the gamesmeister correctly blames his weapons. Go, go, go. Hit the targets. Just be really good at the game. That's my best advice. Be really good at everything. And aim just amazingly. Just perfectly. Aim perfect. Do everything perfectly. That's how you do it. Just perfect, perfect, perfect. What I am really good at. I, I, I challenge anyone to do this. Oh my god, I can't. F this. I challenge anyone to do. Look how quickly I can do I reckon that's less than a second. Look how quickly I can reload the last checkpoint. There should be a trophy for that! Hit the targets. I'm gonna go back to what I go, know. Go, go. And love. Which is that. I'm gonna miss that then as well. I'm in that stage now where um yeah, can't even can't even go, go, go. can't even do that. Two, go. And then you come down here, hit, the hit that. Then you wanna get the flashbang through the door. You don't wanna bounce it off the wall into your face. Let's try the pistol again, shall we? Oh, yeah. oh. Go, go, go. <sighs> woo, 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 woo. The fun song go, go, begins. Go. Sing the fun song if it helps. The fun song. I'm having so much fun. I love to play this bit again and again. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Repeat the same mistakes again. And again. Shoot the other target. Position two. Go. Hit the target. Flashbang through the door. Position four. Hit the target. Hit the other targets. Oh my god! Oh my god! I know! Hit the other targets! Go, go, go. 
Sword of the Storm might say, as he angrily plays through this bit again and again, trying and trying and trying to get that special time that will unlock that trophy so he can get the platinum. How is it only 20 past 5? Does anyone else feel like they've been here for 5 years? Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Position 2, go! Hit the targets! Flashbang through the door! Hit the targets! Position 4! Position 5, go! Hit the targets! Hit the targets! I hope you've been taking some notes, Sword in the Storm. <coughs> so you've got to go, 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 hit the target. All right. Just just do that and be brilliant. Hit everything perfectly. Don't flashbang yourself. Don't get stuck on door frames. Do... I'm not going to get a good run here. This is slow. Missed that last one anyway. An erroneous flashbang in my face just to end it. Have a man shouting at you all the time to go, go, go. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Position two. Go. Hit the target. Flashbang through the door. Hit the target. Position four. Position five. Go. Hit the target. Oh. Go, go, go. Hit the target. How much wisdom can you get in go, one go, go. stream? Remember, every death, every failure makes you more wise. We learn from our mistakes, don't we? So targets. what I like to do is make the mistakes on your behalf go, so go, you go. learn. Hit the target. Oh. Go, go, go. Hit the target. That last one every time. I'm using the pistol, though. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Don't just comment, Mucky Mo, with pistol in caps. All right? It's not doing anyone any good, okay? We've come here to learn. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Go, go, go. Hit the target. Position two. Go. Hit the target. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Oh my god! Go, go, go! Hit the targets! This is my face reading all your comments and loving them.
just a small break to compose myself and that's crucial when you're when you're doing something like this or going for a trophy like this or doing something hard when you feel the frustration start to boil what you need to do is just take a moment just take a breath and as always with the games master streams i like to i like to show you the full process you know i could easily just make a video could you just make a video called how to get under 15 seconds in the fng at the beginning of call of duty 4 modern warfare could easily make that video and you just watch it but i like to i like to dig into the the real process that a gamer will go through when they're trying to do something like this okay there are many stages to it and it's the first attempt which is you know usually a bit rubbish there's a second attempt which is a bit better third attempt better still fourth attempt oh we might be there now fifth attempt so close but still failing and you think ah that was annoying sixth attempt worse seventh attempt you're starting to be rubbish at things that were second nature to you at the beginning okay and i'm showing i'm showing you all of those things okay you, you won't get this anywhere else it's kind of truth and wisdom. Okay? So, Tam, earlier on, I I wouldn't be surprised if tomorrow there's a little message in my inbox from Tam saying, Gamesmeister, thank you so much, O oh wise one. I now have not just the gold relic, but the platinum relic on Stormy Ascent because of what you showed me. And I would also not be at all surprised if when I log on to my computer tomorrow morning, I also have a message from Sword in the Storm saying, Gamesmeister, I don't know what I have done without you. I now have the best of the best trophy in Call of Duty Modern Warfare. In fact, I have the platinum trophy for the game now because that was all I needed. And it will be because I have taken the time to show not just the end result of the process, but the full process. Well, the, the start of the process, anyway. And now, everybody, I've calmed down. I've composed myself. And what I'm about to do will astound you all. I'm about to do FNG. In 15.1 seconds. Go, go, go! Hit the targets! Go back! Shoot the remaining targets. Go back! You passed one of the targets! Hit the other targets. Shoot the other target. Shoot the remaining targets. Hit the other targets. <laughs> Hit the other targets. Hit the other targets. Shoot the other target. <laughs> Hit the other targets. Shut up! Too slow. Get your ah! I know! Obviously! I'm too slow! You're welcome, Sword in the Storm. It's half past five. You're very welcome, everybody. Don't forget to join us later for a special after-party reaction stream to Summer Games Fest and all the wonderful announcements that will be there. I hope you're all excited. And I hope you've all learned much to wisdom today. All right? I'm the Games Meister. I suffer so you don't have to. You're all very welcome. Hit the targets. Go, go, go. Goodbye. Thank you.